Actor Kevin Spacey The Old Vic Theater has said it truly apologizes to anyone affected after an internal investigation resulted in 20 people claiming they experienced inappropriate behavior by former artistic director Kevin Spacey. The London Theater released findings into the allegations against the actor, who was in the role between 2004 and 2015, at a press conference where the theater's executive director, Kate Vera, said it had been dismaying time that she hoped will not color the future of this theater. Kevin Spacey, the theater's current chairman, Nick Clary, issued an apology on behalf of the board of trustees to all those people who felt unable to speak up at the time. Clary said, inappropriate behavior by anyone working at the Old Vic is completely unacceptable. We will foster a safe and supportive environment without prejudice, harassment or bullying of any sort, at any level. We want anyone who works here to feel confident, valued and proud to be part of the Old Vic family. Vera told press the theater apologized to the people who feel they were affected by this. It's really important to understand that there is a new way forward for this organization. We are 200 next year and there has been a very long and vibrant history of this theater and this was a really dismaying time and a discovery that should not, I hope sincerely, color the future of this theater and our ability to work with the people that were affected, understand what went wrong and then move forward and continue to keep this theater that we all love thriving. The theater engaged external law firm Lewis Silkin to investigate claims made against Spacey, and has concluded that, with the exception of one of the claims, none of the reported incidents were raised either formally or informally with management. Everyone is entitled to work in an environment free from harassment and intimidation. Today we commit to a new way forward following the results of our investigation HTTPS dcos 6 bv 5 v the Old Vic at Old Vic Theater November 16, 2017 They also said that none of the Old Vic's trustees were aware of the allegations against the Oscar winner. Lawyer Richard Miskella said there were 56 responses to the confidential email address set up to allow people to come forward with allegation, and those responses included messages from concerned members of the public, former staff and people who had attended events at the theater. If the 56 responses, 20 were personal testimonies alleging inappropriate conduct by Spacey between 1995 and 2013. The allegation in 1995 relates to a project the old Vic was connected with, the press conference was told. All but two of the allegations against Spacey predate 2009 and 16 of the 20 personal testimonies were from former members of staff. Some 14 of the 20 male complainants were told they should consider going to the police, the press conference was told. Three said they had already gone to the police, while the other 11 have not disclosed to the investigation if they will or not. Miss Gella said the allegations made related to a range of behavior, adding they varied from behavior that made people feel uncomfortable to wholly inappropriate behavior. The theater said it had received one testimony where an individual claimed he had informed the manager at the time and the manager didn't do anything. The individual in question asked the investigation not to be taken any further and did not name the manager. Spacey was invited to participate in the investigation but did not respond, Miss Gella said. The investigation further found there was not widespread knowledge of Spacey's alleged behavior and Miss Gella added, there were pockets of the old Vic in which knowledge or suspicion was greater than others, and that did not get escalated. Several of the allegations related to the bar and others to creative spaces such as the stage and rehearsal rooms, he said. It is alleged that more than half of the incidents took place inside the old Vic theater, with the others at external locations. The alleged incidents do not relate to minors under 18 but the complainants would be considered as younger men, the lawyer said. He added that standard mechanisms for complaints were in place but that the review indicated when you're dealing with someone very important, very senior, with real star power behind them, maybe those mechanisms weren't enough. Sexual harassment Spacey has not yet commented on the allegations, and the old Vic has said it has not been possible to verify the claims. Skella said Spacey was invited to participate in the investigation but did not respond. Allegations against Spacey emerged last month when actor Anthony Rapp claimed Spacey had placed him on a bed and climbed on top of him following a party at his apartment in 1986. Others have come forward with allegations against the actor, who is being investigated by police in the UK over an alleged UAL assault in Lambeth, South London, in 2008. Spacey has been contacted by the Press Association for comment on the Old Vic's findings.